Breaking, Trump just busted Obama at the center of Dems biggest scandal yet that'll rip their party apart. Over the past 24 hours, a massive scandal of historic proportions just bust blown wide open involving Hillary Clinton and Barack Obama. We learned of Hillary's blatant act of treason against the United States while she was Obama's Secretary of State, where she transferred 20% of the United States' uranium to Russian mining companies in exchange for a $145 million donation to her Clinton Foundation. Now we're learning about the sick role that then-President Obama played that's so outrageous, that the Senate has now taken action to make Obama pay for his crimes. In the months leading up to the 2016 presidential election, many stories began to circulate about Hillary Clinton's shady relationships with various foreign entities. In the book Clinton Cash published in May 2015, the expose revealed how Hillary benefited directly from a pay-for-play scam she worked while she was Secretary of State, where she schemed up a sweet deal to transfer 20% of the United States' uranium to Russian mining companies in exchange for a $145 million donation to her Clinton Foundation. Hillary's scam involved kickbacks, extortion and money laundering to grow Vladimir Putin's atomic energy business inside the United States. Now breaking reports are confirming Obama's dirty role to sweep the entire thing under the rug and bury the entire investigation. Back in 2009, federal agents used a confidential U.S. witness working inside the Russian nuclear industry to gather extensive financial records, make secret recordings and intercept emails as early as 2009 that showed Moscow had compromised an American uranium trucking firm with bribes and kickbacks in violation of the Foreign Corrupt Practices Act. FBI and court documents show, The Hill reported. But because this racketeering scheme financially benefited the Obama administration, the investigation was swept completely under the rug and Obama prevented the FBI that he controlled from spilling the beans. Rather than bring immediate charges in 2010, however, the Department of Justice, Dosh, continued investigating the matter for nearly four more years, essentially leaving the American public and Congress in the dark about Russian nuclear corruption on U.S. soil during a period when the Obama administration made two major decisions benefiting Putin's commercial nuclear ambitions, the hill went on. Now Trump officials are stepping in, where breaking reports confirm that the Senate has just launched a full-scale probe into the nuclear bribery case, where they are demanding that officials within the FBI disclose exactly what they knew before Obama and his minions approved the uranium deal with the Russians. Senator Chuck Grassley will lead the investigation, where he'll be interviewing Attorney General Jeff Sessions during an oversight hearing that's scheduled to be held on Wednesday. InfoWars reported, Senator Chuck Grassley, R. Iowa, the committee chairman, gets his first chance to raise the issue in public on Wednesday when he questions Attorney General Jeff Sessions during an oversight hearing. Though the hearing was scheduled for other purposes, aides said they expected Grassley to ask Sessions questions about a story published in the Hill on Tuesday that disclosed the FBI had uncovered evidence showing Russian nuclear officials were engaged in a racketeering scheme involving bribes, kickbacks and money laundering designed to expand Russian President Vladimir Putin's atomic energy business on U.S. soil. The evidence was first gathered in 2009 and 2010 but Department of Justice officials waited until 2014 to bring any charges. In between that time, President Obama's multi-agency committee on foreign investment in the United States, CFIUS, gave approval to Russia's Rosatom to buy a Canadian mining company called Uranium One that controlled 20% of America's uranium deposits. But it gets worse. Robert Mueller, who's currently investigating Trump's supposed collusion with the Russians, was the head of the FBI at the time and was working directly with Obama to hide all the evidence of this bribery scheme between Hillary's State Department and the Russians. This is the type of crooked, underhanded behavior we've come to expect from Robert Mueller and his witch hunt against President Trump, Truthfeed News reported. From the Daily Wire, Robert Mueller, who is the special counsel in charge of the Russia investigation, oversaw the FBI when the agency allegedly had evidence it had collected that showed that Russian officials were engaged in a bribery scheme aimed at growing their atomic energy business inside the United States. The details were outlined in a report on Tuesday which showed that the evidence was withheld even from lawmakers as they questioned the Obama administration's approval of the sale of uranium-1 to Russia's Rosatom, which led to Russia controlling 20% of U.S. uranium. Ever since Hillary Clinton lost the election, but hurt liberals across America have been pushing the non-stop narrative that Trump became president by colluding with the Russians. 
How ironic is it that now Hillary and Obama have been caught in a scheme with the Russians that's so extensive? If justice was actually served, they could both be thrown in prison for the rest of their lives. What do you think about this?